The WHO is advising people with COVID-19 symptoms not to take ibuprofen. The global person Christian Lindemeyer warned of the risk of ibuprofen on Tuesday and instead advised self-medicating people with COVID-19 symptoms to take paracetamol, which is found in Tylenol. Ibuprofen is commonly found in Rufen, children's syrup, and tablets in Korea. While ibuprofen has been the go-to remedy for pain, fever, and inflammation, according to the WHO, such anti-inflammatory drugs could boost an enzyme that in turn worsens COVID-19 infections. Recent studies have found popular painkillers to have serious side effects on the heart. Researchers tested 27 different types of prescription painkillers, including the popular ibuprofen. People currently using these painkillers had a 19% higher risk of heart failure than those who had used them in the past. And the higher the dose, the higher risk of heart trouble. Because painkillers change the way the kidneys work and alter salt metabolism, they can contribute to heart failure. Celecoxib was discovered to be the safest painkiller, even though it has long been the least recommended by doctors. Doctors prescribing these drugs should discuss the potential risk with their patients.